from kidsinroomband.com and I'm here with Oh Honey. Can you introduce yourself? I'm Mitchie. I'm Danielle. What Halloween candy did you hate? Did I hate? Um, mounds. <laughs> that's like my favorite candy. No, um, I hate I hate anything with like nuts in it, like peanuts or anything. Like I don't know, I'm, I'm not a big fan of Snickers or anything like that. I don't uh, anything that's like not chocolate. I'm a chocolate girl, so all those like sour, like sour candies and Swedish Fish. I don't like those either. Do you sneeze like a rhino or a mouse? She sneezes like a rhino. A rhino. I sneeze like a mouse. What does that mean? You blow your nose like an 80 year old man. But the question was sneezing. S <clears throat> sneezing. You, blow your, you sneeze like a rhino, definitely. He's, he's mean to me. <laughs> Never mean to her. <laughs> so mean to me. Never. <clears throat> if we were at a soundtrack for a movie, what kind of movie would it be? Um, either like a Will Ferrell movie or like a funny one, like with Will Ferrell and like John C. Riley, or like. I would love to do like a, like a Wes Anderson movie. Um, I think it'd be cool to do a soundtrack for a movie like Juno or something like that. Michael Sarah. What song does everybody in the band sing along to when you hear it on the radio? Uh, hmm. Well, we don't really listen to the radio a lot, but when songs come on like our playlists and stuff like that, probably Echo by R. Kelly. We were really into Classic by MKTO this summer though. That was a big one. At least I was singing along. <laughs> what was your least favorite chore as a kid? Least favorite toy? Chore. Chore. All of them? <laughs> <laughs> of course. All of them. Um, hmm. Probably making my bed because it was next to the wall and it was so difficult. How old were you when you went to your first concert and who did you see? I was, I think, probably, how old are you? Nine. Nine, I was a little longer, younger than you, so I was probably about like six or seven, and it was Shania Twain, Shania Twain and Alan Jackson. I was nine, and I saw the Backstreet Boys um, Millennium Tour, it was awesome. What song do you hate having stuck in your head? Honestly, I hate having our own song stuck in my head. Because, I mean, I know that sounds bad, but it's like, <laughs> I, I don't know. It's just like I feel like I feel like what's the word I'm looking for? I feel egotistical when I get stuck in my head because I'm like, no, you're not supposed to have your own song stuck in your head. You're supposed to have other people's songs stuck in your head. But sometimes I wake up in the morning with like our single stuck in my head. Um, whenever we see our friends who are in bands or we meet new bands, I start to get one of their songs stuck in my head and I'll start singing it and then I feel really awkward because I'm like talking to them. So that's definitely my biggest. If you were on wrestling the Mo the Mowgli's or American Authors, who do you think you would win again? The Mowgli's have so many people, we would definitely lose to them. Just they have they got the numbers. There's like seven of them. <laughs> and the American authors are pretty in shape. They guys. are, they're really in shape. They like run every day before the shows. I think we would lose to both to yeah. both bands. <laughs> that's funny. Unfortunately. And finally, can you name all the spice? Yes. Baby Sporty. Yeah. Baby Spice. Baby Spice. Sporty, sporty Spice. Scary and Posh. Posh. Baby Sporty, Scary, Posh. And Ginger. Oh, you're right. There's five of them. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. you. <laughs> I loved the Spice Girls movie. It was awesome. <clears throat>